U.S. Pavement Services was founded as Seal Coat Inc. in 1985 by Mike Musto. After starting with residential driveways, the company quickly began performing its seal coating and asphalt maintenance services for commercial clients. Their very first was Papa Gino's, who is still a customer 30 plus years later. By 1987, Mike and Margaret Musto, his wife, welcomed their son David into their family. Mike's first Father's Day that year was marked by a wonderful site visit to a sealed coating property for Mass Bank in Wilmington, Massachusetts, also still a customer today. David, now the Senior Vice President of Sales, has been in the business his entire life. In 1989, the company was renamed to U.S. Seal Coat, and in need of a shop for dispatching, Mike chose Woburn, Massachusetts as home for the company's headquarters, still our home today. In 1994, U.S. Seal Coat brought line painting and paving services in-house under the name U.S. Paving, bringing all in-house services under one roof, still a point of pride today. In 2002, during a period of rapid growth, Mike invited nephew and current COO Andrew Musto to join the company while he was still in college. Andrew focused on job costing and helping in operations initially, quickly taking on other roles like logistics planning and managing the newly developing national accounts. By 2005, U.S. Seal Coat and U.S. Paving was growing rapidly, with in-house crews operating throughout the New England area and a handful of partners in other markets. Mike acquired 1-800-PAVEMENT to help catalyze brand recognition this is widely recognized as the best marketing move in the company's history, quickly seeing call volumes multiply several times over in the first year. Because of the success, I've acquired these other 800 vanity numbers for our industry and started licensing them to pavement contractors by area code throughout the U.S. and Canada. In 2008, the company became U.S. Pavement Services to better reflect the range of pavement services offered. In the same year, the business would go on to nearly $20 million in revenue. As the recession hit, U.S. Pavement's conservative approach positioned the company well, emerging with a nationally recognized brand, a fleet covering all of the Northeast U.S., and most importantly, a team of dedicated professionals now numbering more than 100 members committed to being the best in the pavement industry. In 2010, U.S. Pavement Services teamed up with the Boston Red Sox, becoming their official pavement services provider. With this collaboration, U.S. Pavement hosts a celebration for veterans during a Red Sox home game each year, which has grown to more than 300 veterans and their families annually. In 2012, at our industry's national convention in Memphis, Tennessee, Mike and U.S. Pavement Services unveiled the industry's first and only Made in America campaign. This initiative provided resources and tools for pavement contractors to find and secure American-made goods and services. Inspired by the heroes we met during these veterans' events, Mike started the pledge to hire veterans. This initiative is focused on helping to pave the way for companies nationwide to support veterans and their families, including Mike and Margaret's son-in-law, First Lieutenant Mike Shaughnessy, husband of their daughter Jessica, who works on the company's national accounts team. In 2015, the company continued to deliver on the increasingly in-depth projects our customers need, adding milling services in-house, as well as a complete project management team. One of the high points of our story happened in 2016. U.S. Pavement Services was named the number one contractor in the U.S. out of a field of over 25,000 eligible contractors by the voice of our industry, Pavement Magazine. The future looks bright as U.S. Pavement continues to expand capacity, opening operations in Canada and Florida in 2018, improving operational efficiency with significant investments in systems, training, and job management tools, and focusing on our most important goal, 100% customer satisfaction. We look forward to the next chapter in the U.S. Pavement Services story.